a rare event that people have been talking about now for months. Today, there are signs that the cicadas are starting to emerge in our area. NBC5's Charlie Wojciechowski talked to people who've discovered some at the DuPage County Forest Preserve. Jennifer Ridzewski and Matt Adams are on the hunt. They know cicadas are about to emerge at the Willowbrook Wildlife Rehabilitation and Education Center in Glen Ellen, but in one tiny little spot tucked away in the DuPage County Forest Preserve, they already have. There's a dead one there. Here, in an area still under construction, a wall of cicadas, or at least they're no longer needed exoskeletons climbing up a fence. It's kind of cool. I think bugs are really neat. They're underappreciated, and to see this phenomenon of nature happening in real life, I think is a special treat. Matt discovered the insects while walking the property. Some of the first of the 17 year periodical cicadas to be spotted above ground in the Chicago area. They're much smaller than the yeah. annual cicadas. But Jennifer says these bugs may no longer be with us. Part of nature's cycle of life. Groups of animals just waiting for these guys to come out to make lunch out of? Right, yeah, so there's, you know, all different kinds of birds will eat them, chipmunks, um, raccoons, a lot of animals get a lot of extra nutrition when they start emerging. So this is a forest preserve smorgasbord. It is. So why here and why now? Well, a lot of it may have to do with this black fencing. When the soil temperature eight inches below the ground gets to 64 degrees. So I'm guessing because this black fencing is um, radiating that heat onto the bare soil. It's getting a little bit warmer in this area, which is why we're seeing a little patch of these cicadas emerging right here. If you're looking for cicadas, you might want to do what Jennifer is doing. Look under every log for the telltale holes the bugs will use to make their exit. If you have trees that have been around for 17 years, then you're most likely going to have cicadas. So when will the rest of the cicadas still underground follow these into the open? Jennifer says, watch your thermometer then check your trees. In Glen Ellen, Charlie Wojciechowski, NBC5 News. Little natural aerators right there. Charlie, thank you so much.